God's message for you today. Sometimes we desire it so earnestly that we attempt to make it happen on our own. We pray, we fast, we cry, we plead with God, and it leads us into a pit of exhaustion. But occasionally, God allows us to reach this point. He wants us to get worn out so we have no choice but to lay it down and leave it at his feet. If this is you, if you're tired and weary, feeling burnt out, then let go. The Father is just waiting for you to release so you can receive. Because in the end, only he can fulfill a promise that he has spoken. Like this video if you believe in God. A touch from God was the reason someone was healed. A touch from God was the reason somebody felt valued. A touch from God was the reason somebody didn't give up on life. A touch from God was the reason someone had peace and comfort today. A touch from God is the reason somebody's situation was changed. A touch from God was the reason the impossible happened for somebody. What makes you think that he doesn't have the ability in your life? It might seem like you're far behind, forgotten, or alone. But a touch from God can change all of that in seconds. Perhaps this is the time you've been waiting for. The moment that God has been preparing you for. The moment where the Lord steps in and finally does that thing. The moment when the promise is met by God's faithful hand. Maybe it didn't happen in the past. Maybe it didn't happen when you wanted it to. But your promise is right on schedule. Perhaps you were born for such a time as this. Type Amen if you want to claim it. The beautiful thing about it all is that God knows. You don't have to explain it or know what to say. God knows your mind, your fears, and your desires. It's up to you to believe that God is for you. Stand on the word and tell fear that he is a liar. No matter how real it feels, you can't give in. God is for you not against you. Allow him to bless the desires of your heart. Don't let those fears be what's watering your life, or those fears will only grow. Water your life in the faith of all your desires and hopes, for God is for you and not against you. Type 999 to claim it. Type Jesus is Lord. If you love Jesus and share this video to friends who love God to claim it, and if you already done, type, Yes, God. He will come. He will rescue you. He will make a way. He will deliver the promise. He will heal you. He will restore you. The same God who split the Red Sea for Moses and the Israelites will surely do it for you. It might look hopeless, and your life might feel dark, but any moment now, your sea will part. Any moment now, you will walk into your promised place, and your enemies won't be able to touch you. Type 222 to claim it. But don't let time fool you. It's easy to watch it pass and believe that it's far too late to see the promise. It's easy to believe that it's over when you've spent so much time praying and fasting with no results. But in these times, you must remember that God is in control of time. He works in sudden lies. It's not too early and not too late. Your promise is about to arrive on time. It's in the lowest point in your life that God will find you. 
You might get to the point of living out your ways and doing things your way to avoid the pain of your spiritual walk. God will find you there and he will have you start walking again. We do have a choice, but it's almost hard to pass up this beautiful offer. He knows your most honest and truest desires, the ones you bury deep. He offers to not only bless you, but to show you the best kind of love and faithfulness. His love is unconditional, and he is faithful when we are faithless. Rest in his love and peace. Amen. Type 1111 to claim it. I know often the pain of our mistakes and struggles leave us as prisoners. I know it's not easy to move past the pain and forget, but nothing will stop his blessings, and nothing makes him love you less. Let his love bring you peace, and let all the hurt be washed away and forgotten. He is faithful to love and faithful to forgive. His love for you is everlasting, and when you feel unworthy, Remember that you are a beautiful soul to him and you are forgiven. His sacrifice was the most beautiful symbol of forgiveness and love. Amen. Let his love be your shelter. Let his love be a shield. His love is free and given unconditionally. Not one of you is more or less important. His love is so powerful that he sees you, and though he already knows your heart and all you want and need to say, he still wants to hear you. His love is so deep that it covers all mistakes. You don't have to beg. It is given with open arms. His love is deeper than the ocean and greater than the sky. His love stretches beyond limits, and it's all because he didn't need you, but he wanted you. He didn't have to take that cross, but he did. He didn't have to love us, but he saw us as worthy. That is why you should always remember that there is a love that goes beyond limits, and that love is his love type 333 to claim it. Maybe you feel that your life has been stagnant and that God has you on pause, but in every season there is a wonderful purpose. Even the pause is teaching you so many wonderful things. Maybe he's wanting to draw near, maybe he has some things he wants to show you, but he needs your undivided attention. Maybe, just maybe, he's about to blow your mind. Embrace the pause and know that everything will soon change. Today, hold on to the promises God gave you. Find hope in the words he whispered to your heart in the quiet. They're still alive and marinating in the Father's hands. They're still as true as they were the day he spoke them. The way has been made. It'll be more beautiful than expected. You can let go and rely on him. He is faithful in his precious timing. Type Amen if you believe in 